Home opener at the beginning of our season. It's obviously important to get off on the right foot. Um, been here for almost well, a little over two weeks. Um, feel good about our progress. Feel like we've made some strides in some areas we need to get better at. We still got a lot of areas to get better at. Um, but feel good in the progress so far. Uh, girls are excited to play. I uh, look forward to starting the season. Um, still trying to find out about the group. I mean, you're, you're constantly as a coach evaluating the group and finding out strengths and weaknesses and people that rise to the occasion and not. But we, we have a pretty good grasp on them and still want to see more games out of some. Um, but just excited to get started and to be at home is special. And so much of, of our season and our success depends on really and truly a lot that doesn't have anything to do with the ball. Um, being a college athlete is exactly that. I mean, a student athlete, uh, class is starting, adds a different dimension to them, you know, making sure they're prepared for class and studying and getting up early in the mornings. Um, hydration and nutrition is a big part of that. Um, and just taking care of your bodies and making right choices. And, and the younger ones, it's something a lot of them have to learn and get into a routine. Uh, at the college level, it, it, during your season, is very compact. It's two and a half months. It's very grueling on your body, mentally and physically. And so it's all about adapting to that. And that I, Todd and I both believe that's a big part of our success is being able to adapt and do those things correctly. So some of them, it's a learning curve right now and learning how to do that. The veterans get it, and then they should fall right in suit right away. Um, but yeah, it's definitely a huge part of success. I've been here, this is my third year, or fourth year, uh, fourth season with the team, and it, it hadn't been easy. I mean, we've, we've had some rough times and kind of rebuilding, and a lot of these players have been there with me. And, um, you know, we've gone through that process. We've learned a lot about ourselves and, and about the program, and there's a real sense of determination within this group right now. They feel like they have a lot to prove. They're very hungry, and we've talked about it a lot. Uh, and I, th I think that's what you see. Um, I can't predict what the final outcome of our season is going to be. What I can tell you is they're going to give me everything they, they got and they're going to be very focused on what they're doing. Definitely during all the practices and stuff, very intense, very into all the drills. We were paying attention to what Chad and Todd are saying to us. We're trying to soak in as much information as possible, looking at film, our shape, just trying to get every second out of our practices to make us a better team and to keep growing and keep getting better. Um, my keys to the game probably just, you know, if there's going to be mess ups, you're going to, you might have a bad touch on the ball. Just keep your head up, keep going. Um, your team around you is going to be there to support you. Um, they're going to back you up. They're going to slot balls in for you and all that. So um, keep the game, just stay mentally tough and um, just don't back down. I can't, like, there's no words to express how exciting this is and just to be back and with the team and um, I just, I can't wait. I mean, if, you know, in terms of the games this weekend, uh, a big focus for us this year as a coaching staff more than, more than team, but definitely one of our goals is to really take one game at a time. Uh, I think over the past seasons as a coach, I've, I've maybe talked too much and put too much pressure on them in terms of what was happening around them all the time. And uh, so we've, we've made an emphasis this year to take one game at a time and just focus on that opponent. That's what we're going to do. We're not looking forward to anything beyond Friday night. Um, Lipscomb, uh, don't know a lot about them as a team. Um, their head coach is a really good friend of Todd of mine, Kevin O'Brien. Um, he's been there. He got the job a year ago and uh, hold him to very high regard. He'll do a phenomenal job there and they will come here ready to play. No question about it. Um, but we're looking forward to it. And it's really, honestly, more about us than anybody we play. We've got to be prepared. Uh, we got to have the right focus, and we have to be sharp. And uh, for us, it's it's about uh, 90 minutes, coming out and playing 90 minutes and playing our style and uh, competing. We can't wait to get started. We've been working real hard in preseason, just um, as a team, and we're bonding really well. We're getting along, and the team chemistry is there. And just from last week's game in High Point, I think. We start off real strong. We just need to continue working hard and to the right direction.